is now underway downtown. Changes that protect lesbian, gay, bisexual, and transgender people. News 4's Darlene Dorsey is live downtown at this public hearing with the very latest. Darlene. Yes, the count keeps climbing. Right now, more than 460 people are signed up to speak. Just look at the lines behind me. Folks are fired up about this issue, and they want their opinions heard. The line wrapped around city council chambers. Heat was not an issue for folks fired up about the non-discrimination ordinance changes. San Antonio needs to make that point that this is something worth coming down here for. There are two overflow rooms for people to listen in. Devin Gonzalez signed up at 8. She picked up her kids from school and rushed back with homework and signs supporting ordinance changes protecting people who are LGBT. We need our children to know how people are supposed to be treated. A message of hate is not something that is acceptable in schools, in government, in the workplace. Veterans of the armed forces are also included in the proposed changes. Not necessary, says this Vietnam vet. When my brothers and I came back from Vietnam both times, we were greeted with insults. Uh, we were sped on. We were insulted and all that. But we made it. We survived. And it didn't take a city ordinance to protect us. He stands for freedom, he says, but city code does not need to change to help people in the LGBT community. I should not be limited or be afraid to voice my beliefs and my position in the issue, on the issue. It's a hot topic, and at 6.30, we'll certainly have more on the meeting. This Saturday, a group of supporters of the ordinance changes will be in front of North Star Mall, and council is expected to vote on this issue on September 5th. Downtown, Darlene Dorsey, News 4, San Antonio.